So, look at this crazy mess here. This is the one that sparked it Mommy, all. It My first little indoor setup that led to me doing something in the back. I had them in there for a little minute and then it led to this. Now, this right here is something serious. This is a legit indoor garden. That boy, boy there, done touch the light. Ain't that something? So look at that. So I need to clean this up because the little plants, they are getting no light. <laughs> So I need to see if I can rescue those ones that's just getting stumped out because all these other ones decided to get all big. That's a trip. So let me show you the other side over here. Be back in a second. So check out this side here. These bok choy's were a little experiment I was doing, I was growing some microgreens and a few of them, you know, I took to see if I could grow them. Now, everything was going well until I decided to do these and these are okras and they just grew so tall that I had to raise the light up. And because of that, the bok choy stopped getting light. So I'm going to have to do an experiment to try to rescue these and see if I can get them looking better again. Because look at this one here. Because this big old plant start blocking out all the light. This one is suffering. But look at the stalks on this thing. That is just crazy to me. But yeah, I just wanted to do a little video to show my little indoor garden and you know just show me practicing growing food because you don't have to have a lot of space and have a big backyard and all that stuff you know you can grow some food and I decided to do you know little YouTube videos that hopefully I can inspire others to you know just try a little something something you know don't have to be perfect as you see mine ain't perfect but they used to look very green and pretty so now i'm gonna trim all these leaves and i'm gonna feed them to my birds <clears throat> and whatever i don't feed to my birds i'll feed to my worms but i'm gonna trim them up real nice and more than likely take these Put them with the other um, tall plants on the other side and put them on the shelf and give them better light in because these things are starting to flower. So I need to find out if I'm going to need to pollinate those or what I need to do because I think they're ready to start giving me some okra. So I will bring y'all along for the ride and do more updates as I go. All right. Until the next video. Bye bye.